Well, this weekend was a busy one for one young man well on his way to earning his Eagle Scout Merit Badge. The Wiley High School junior tackling a project at the Presbyterian Encampment in Buffalo Gap, a place meaningful to both his family and many generations of campers in the big country. Kate Hebb's Mariah Williams has the details. It was all hands on deck at 100-year-old Buffalo Gap Presbyterian Camp. <laughs> One Boy Scout giving back to a place he's been a part of for years. We are replacing the pews or benches underneath this several hundred year old Trinity tree. JT Parton is a junior at Wiley High School, also yearning to become an Eagle Scout. One requirement is having a project that will better the community. I chose this project specifically because I remember back whenever I was little kid I came out here for the first time and I came in this Trinity tree. It was just a very special moment for me and it felt like I was enclosed in nature and connected with God. Decorative cement lining the area to the Trinity tree, one of the main places of gatherings and worships at the camp. Camp manager James Myers has worked with Parton many years and was not surprised with Parton wanting to dedicate his project to the camp. We're always trying to do some touch up. If we see something that needs doing, he doesn't mind jumping in and doing it. I said, well, okay, let's, let, you know, your project, you take off, do what you need to do, and let me know what, how I can help. Parton's mom, Lauren, saying the community involvement has been the biggest help. We have just been overwhelmed by the donations. Um, JT wrote letters and sent them out to friends and family and community members. He's raised over $3,000, almost $4,000. After two days of hard work, many helping hands and dedication, Parton will have one more badge to add to his 12 years of experience as a Boy Scout. <laughs> making the old camp look anew. Reporting in Buffalo Gap with coverage you can count on, I'm Mariah Williams, KTAB News. Thank you, Mariah. I can speak from personal knowledge of this young man. He is a tremendous young man, so big congratulations. And along with the generous donations from Home Depot, Parton also received donations from members of the community. They provided meals and other services. So job well, well done. And